so glad that you're up with us this morning. With the kids out of school for the summer, you're probably planning more family events, vacations, staycations. So we're here to help you find fun things to do that won't break the bank. And I found one for you inside. Paul Berg, executive director of the Carrollwood Cultural Center, is with us today. Thanks for being with us. Thank you. I'm excited to talk about the summer concert series. Absolutely. You guys have going on. First, though, for people who aren't aware, can you tell us a little bit about the Carrollwood Cultural Center? Sure. Uh, we opened our doors in 2008, and we are a public-private partnership between Hillsborough County and the Friends of Carrollwood Cultural Center, which is a nonprofit organization. We run classes throughout the week, Monday through Saturday, everything from art classes, pottery, music, dance. We even have yoga classes in there. Uh, and that, those are for all ages. Uh, we run events throughout the year, concerts, plays. We have a full theater production uh, company that we have in-house. We have a, offer rental program for the community. So if you're looking for a, a location for a business uh, meeting, sure even up to weddings and wedding receptions. I even have somebody on staff that can perform a wedding if you need that. So. <laughs> okay, so coming up, it was really exciting. You guys have a summer concert yeah. series inside in the AC. Absolutely. And it's affordable. Yes. So we actually kick off that summer concert series tomorrow afternoon at 4 o'clock with uh, an event we call Strings in Spring. And it's uh, Franz Mantini and Tiffany Liu, uh, classical pianist and a, a classical violinist. It's a, a phenomenal thing. I heard them rehearsing this week. We follow that up with a Dixieland jazz band. And then uh, a really cool event we've been doing for several years is called uh, a Girls Night Out Comedy Night. It's three female oh. comedians uh, featured. It's a really neat event. And then we go into uh, James Taylor experience. Um, a tribute to uh, to James Taylor that's so good you'd swear he's up on stage. <laughs> and we close out the summer concert series with an event called Mad Dogs, the Joe Cocker Experience. Okay, you guys have a packed schedule. We do. Aside from the summer concerts, what else? You said you have pottery and yoga. What else do you have going on yeah. that the community can get involved in? So summers are easily our busiest time of year. Besides our summer concert series, our classes, our rentals, we offer nine weeks of summer camp. Uh, starting June 5th. Ah, great way, great it, thing for the kids. It is. It's an awesome time. It's great to have those kids in. It's just a great energy to have in the building. It's a, it's a lot of fun to see kids that, you know, sometimes this is their first experience at camp. Sure. And they're a little shy and sure. reserved. And by the end of the week, we've got them up on stage and performing. Paul, tell me, how can we learn a little bit more about uh, your nonprofit? Sure. Uh, they can call us at 813-269-1310. Uh, they can visit us on our website, carolwoodcenter.org. We've got a Facebook page, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, All of it. Yeah, we'll send up more signals if you need it. Okay, and of course, we're going to put information on how to get in touch with you guys on our website, so you great. can find it at abcactionnews.com. Paul, thanks for being with us today. Thank you. Good luck. Thank Have a you. great summer. Thanks.